We love looking our best, but do you know some of the personal care products you use can be bad for you? And that's why the wife and wife team of Natural Passion for Wellness, Swan Dances with Breeze, and Ami Diaz is here with us to guide us through some of those uh, pretty much items that we thought were going to make us look beautiful and everything, but actually are a little harmless for us. But also that's where you two have come in to kind of like guide people through with your own products, but also educate people, which is so important. Right, Swan? Yes, Breeze? absolutely. That's so, correct. Let's talk about uh, the natural for wellness. Um, natural passion, passion for, for wellness. wellness. There yes. we go. So <laughs> tell me a little about you. So natural passion for wellness, how it came about is basically it's a personal story. I had some issues with my skin ever since I was an infant. For a very long time, I pretty much looked like I had a sunburn all over my body. So it started from that, and there wasn't anything out there that would help me with my skin. And uh, just speeding forward, I started to learn a bit more about ingredients because my skin was reacting. Right. Researching those ingredients, I thought that they were natural and realize even when they say they're natural, sometimes they actually will make the skin yeah. react. Especially when you see that oil-free situation. And, and to me, okay. that's where you come in a little bit because your background is in researching, seeing this. And we were just talking that um, some of those products out there are starting to be banned, which is very interesting, that we thought were great for us and making us looking beautiful. That's true, Brad. And the worst part about it is, a, is that they should be tested and even though they have been banned, they're still being put out on the shelf. Yeah. Which it, it makes us as consumers have to make sure that we are doing our part and looking at the ingredients, doing a little bit more research, even just as simple as Googling it, right? Yeah. It's funny, I, I saw a documentary on the cosmetic world where there's no regulations really on some of this stuff. So it, again, you said it's up to us. And that's why you have come out with a little line here yes. um, that is very important because one, you're looking at the things that don't need to be on our bodies, which is so important. Um, but it's so funny when people do make their own home rem own, own uh, recipes or own uh, makeup stuff, mm -hmm. they're looking at the big markets but not realizing some of that stuff they've used is banned. Mm -hmm. so. That is correct, absolutely correct. Uh, there's a lot of people out there doing DIY products. Yeah. A lot, and it's actually doing a lot more harm to their skin than they actually realize, like you said. They're doing. So, okay, yeah. so you got me going through a test here. Yeah. And they're like, oh, you need something on your hands, Brad. You need <laughs> something does. there's hands. So, you need some love. <laughs> leave some love on my hands. So, because I will say, I do use over-the-counter products. It's kind of interesting. Like, for my face, I'll go and find those natural, you know, right ones for me. Mm -hmm. But when it comes to other parts of my body, I'm kind of like using over-the-counter stuff. And is that what some people do, actually, Amy? A, a lot of people do. But they're also still using the same type of ingredients, you know, soap and water, or even something as natural based as like coconut oil. Yeah. You know, for their face. So, mm -hmm. all right, what do we have here, and what are we gonna do? So, all right. So this is from our our uh, skincare line. Okay. This is called our three step regimen. So we have our youthful cleanser, our balancing toner, and our protective moisturizer. And there's natural SPF in there. So we don't use any of the oxides like zinc oxide or titanium dioxide, which typically are in the majority yeah. of SPF type of skincare or even makeup. Yeah. So we don't use any of that, which oh. are, those are nanoparticles. Many people don't know that. Wow. All right, let's go ahead and give it a try here. Okay. Um, and also we got to mention that the big part is, go, keep on going, I'm going to start mm -hmm. talking as we're going through here, okay. is that people of color or, or even, you know, with that tan skin need to really watch out what they're putting on because it's a lot different than what we could say the makeup companies have been putting out there. Correct. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Yeah. So. Absolutely. The, the wonderful thing about these products is that we are both licensed professionals. So it is a lot different from somebody who's just, you know, doing a DIY style. Yeah. We actually have the knowledge, we actually know how to use the ingredients and combine them properly to be able to um, make the best products for people, for ourselves and for people. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. great. Okay, what'd you just put on me? So this is the first step, the youthful cleanser. Okay. There, there's a lavender powder in here, so it has a natural exfoliant to it without it being uh, harsh. So we're just going to uh, rub it in. There's aloe vera gel in there, so it's very hydrating. It's gonna help to fill in those fine lines and wrinkles. Yeah. So it'll plump up the skin. And so, and I've been noticing too, like what people will do is like, well, that that's breaking me out or this is breaking me out, but it's really not 
the natural stuff, it's the chemicals they do to put in there to make them smell good or anything. And that usually is what happens. The fragrances. The fragrances. Exactly. So, all right, yep. are we, oh, okay, we keep going here. We're going to come back. But I also want to mention that you're going to be out at the, of course, the Arizona Fall Fest coming up, which mm -hmm. is going to be on November 5th at Margaret T. Hanson Park. It's yeah. your first festival kind of like going to, so people yes. come out and demonstrate and, and see what you're doing. Yes, Correct. and we also have a, a, a code for the viewers for today for the next uh, 24 hours till midnight. Anybody who puts goes to our website and puts in the code AZ7 gets an additional savings. I like that. There you go. And tell them the website where they can go to. So you go to naturalpassionforwellness.com. So, and that's uh, the number four.